So, my eyes have been opened, and you know what I saw when I looked around? Corn? No, I saw you. I now know that every man wants something to call his own. And with that in mind, I'm going to give you the 200 acres we got from the Pritchards. Set in a southern Iowa farming community, actors Dennis Quaid and Zac Efron play a quarreling father and son. It was very funny to play a character who just can't stand to be around him. Um, you know, I was right to check in with him after every take. Like, We're good, right? I'm not staying here, Dad. I'm racing cars. Racing cars is a great hobby. You don't even sponsor me. You sponsor that Arthur Link kid. The Links have been buying seeds for me for 10 years. Besides, you can't make any money racing. Yeah, you can make good money. Director Ramin Barani knew immediately that Zack was the one for the role and is sure the young heartthrob has a promising future. I think it took me about 10 seconds to know this is the guy. And he delivered. He knew the part. He knew the character. He's from a small town. Don't think otherwise. He's from a small town, John Steinbeck country in California. I understood him in certain ways um, very strongly, his relationship with his family and with his father. Uh, loving his father very much, but not at all wanting to follow in his footsteps. Um, he feels that his father has this uh, sort of skewed perspective of the American dream, which is expand or die. And it's led him to his father being a pretty ruthless guy in many ways. So Dean's sort of um, racing to get away from father, following in his father's footsteps. Why does he consistently disrespect me? If I like what I see today, we'll give you one and only one shot. That foot is made of lead. It's gonna get you to NASCAR. You're not gonna make it in the big leagues. Take the land. It's in your blood. It's the beginning of something completely different for Zach. He's going down the roads of Johnny Depp and Tom Cruise and what Paul Newman did. And I think you're gonna be very surprised by what you see from Zach here. Somebody who was a lot less impressed by Zach was newcomer Micah Monroe. I grew up with Zach on the cover of magazines and, and you know, Dennis and incredible films, but, you know, it's just, and you know, once you get to know them, you know, they're just, they're normal people. And Zach's behind there picking his nose, just no. by the way. <laughs> In the movie, Micah plays Zach's love interest, and the two lovebirds are even rumored to be dating in real life. Even though nothing's been confirmed just yet, in the film you can see how well they fit together. But don't take it too seriously. You're Henry Whipple's son, right? Yeah, don't know me. I'm Meredith. And I'm his girlfriend. Hi. We're gonna meet some people at Slippers for drinks. Do you wanna join us? Oh, how old are you? Actually, don't tell me. I don't wanna feel old. <laughs> she was pretty. I didn't notice. Zach and, and Micah, he's playing his girlfriend, are so good and had such a chemistry that in their most sweet moment in the film, I let it run one minute, no cutting, no editing, one minute uninterrupted. I have plenty of shots, but I look at them and I'm like, the two of them are so good together and so talented, there's no reason to cut. Curious about that scene? Then check out At Any Price in cinemas now. Who could have done this? You didn't talk, did you? Tell me who it was. You ruined me. If they find out, We'll lose everything. I don't know what to do. You're in trouble, aren't you? Call off the agents. Call them off. 